So here we have a log problem that we're trying to show that the left-hand side is equal to the right-hand side. So I like to start these problems by simplifying the more complicated side. So I'll start with the left-hand side. And there's a lot of ways that we could start with this problem, um, but I'll just show one, pot one possible method. And if you have any questions or if you would um, do it in a different way, feel free to leave those comments in the comment section down below. And um, I could do another video starting from a different method. So first, let's notice that we have division within a log. So we can use the rule that if we have log base b of x over y, that we can write that as log base b of x minus log base b of y. So I'm going to start by separating this into log base 10 of x to the power of 4, the top part, minus log base 10 of the bottom, which is 100. And I'll bring down the rest of the left-hand side. Okay, so from here, let's see what else we can do to simplify. Here we have a log base 10 of x to the power of 4, and we have minus a log base 10 of x to the power of 3. So using this rule in reverse, we can put log base 10, we can put the x to the fourth on the top and the x to the third on the bottom, since this would be log base 10 of x to the fourth minus log base 10 of x to the third. And I combine those because x to the fourth divided by x to the third simplifies down to just x. So I can write that as log base 10 of x. So that simplified things a bit. Let me bring down what else we have left is the log base 10 of 100 and log base 10 of 9x. Okay, so from here, if I see that what's inside my log is a a multiple or an exponent of the base, I, it can be helpful to write that what's in the log as with the base of this number. So we can write 100 as 10 squared. So if we write 100 as 10 squared, and I'll bring the rest of that down, once we write 100 as 10 squared, we can use the rule that says log base b of x to the power of n. We can kick that exponent down to the front to make it n log base b of x. So I'm going to kick this square down to the front to make this log base 10 of x minus 2 log base 10 of 10, and then plus log base 10 of 9x. Okay, the next rule that I'm going to use is log base 10 of 10. If we ever have log base b of b, that is equal to 1. So because the base is equal to what's inside the log, we can simplify that down to just 1. And that leaves us with log base 10 of x minus 2 times 1, which is just 2, plus log base 10 of 9x. Okay, and now, now that I have two x terms, now that I have two logs with the x's left in them, we can use the rule, one more rule, that log base b of x plus log base b of y is equal to log base b of x times y. So I'm going to give myself just a bit more room. And I'll combine these two terms by multiplying what's on the inside. So 9, 9x times x is 9x squared. So that'll make log base 10 of 9x squared minus 2. And from here, um, 
I'll just go out to the side since I'm trying to make it look like this. I don't want to scroll up too far. I can write my 9, because 9 is a perfect square, I can write that as log base 10 of 3x all squared. So that's because 3 squared is 9 and then x squared is x squared. And then I can use this rule again. When I have an exponent, I can kick it to the front and I can make that 2 log base 10 of 3x minus 2. And then if I factor out my 2 and I move my terms, move the negative 2 to the front, I would get 2 times negative 1 plus log base 10 of 3x, which is what I was trying to make it look like. So there we go. I hope this video step-by-step -step solution was helpful for you. If it was, please like the video and subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see more homework help solutions such as this one. Also share with anybody who you think might find these step-by-step -step videos helpful. And, um, and there's also information down in the description about if you would like to contact me for tutoring. I do online tutoring as well as if you would like to support my homework help project of bringing free homework help solutions to anybody who needs it, I have Patreon for recurring help or I, can, I also have PayPal that you can support my channel on a one-time basis. Thanks for watching.